I'm not filming anything in particular. I just wanted to show the state of play with the sun. It's literally just gone behind that roof. Now that's completely silhouetted now against the sky, but effectively we're still daylight. There's still some sun on the trees. Um, so that's the state of play. I mean, obviously my video camera is doing adjustments. Now we'll go inside. Right, what I wanted to show, although it's not completely dark yet, the um, lights that fall on the um, area here. I've just got my DSLR out and took some readings on the plants in the garden. And the reading in here is exactly the same. So these lights under these conditions are giving the same light as outside on a shady day. That's not bad. I'm quite, and that's at that distance. That's not close in. So uh, I think these are going to do the job. Um, they're certainly better than no light at all. Better than they th I thought they would be at that distance. Because I mean, effectively, the... Um, manufacturer actually says that you know there's a, a good growing light level a meter away from the light and um, these plants are more like five feet away from the light but they're still going to get a lot more light than they've ever had before in the winter simply because I'm extending the days so I'll have to stop talking about these oh, and when the temperatures dip down and we get the short days everything will stop growing well I'm still going to get the temperature drop but uh, not necessarily the shorter days. I think these lights give a general light level that would be equivalent to the middle of the day on a cloudy day. And bearing in mind that's what I get a lot of through the winter and far less hours of it, I think the plants are actually gonna, in the main, keep ticking over instead of slowing down virtually to a stop. So, it's doing the job, or it appears to be. And it'll be very difficult to prove it one way or the other, quite honestly. Still, it's a bit of fun. And at the end of the day, it's a new game for me. You know, it's um, <clears throat> something to remember to turn on as that sun drops down behind that house, like it was when I was outside. I remember to come in here and turn the lights on. And then depending on what time it got light in the morning, I add 11 hours onto that and that's when I turn them off. So they get 11 hours of effective daylight. So should be good. But anyway, we'll see how we go.